ourselves a goodie the number one seed gators versus the baltimore vipers i'm live right now i'm lj smith alongside here with ike johnson and we got the 301 throw out here with with your favorite right here marty Mar, right yeah uh, yeah friend. yeah let's go see here i take it away here Odie throwing it off marty on a return ah, marty Ooh. 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 okay good return First down coming up. Got your first seed, Gators, against your Baltimore Vipers. Mark at the QB. You got Momo in the backfield. Keon out here at the wide. Ooh. Fake pitch out there. To, oh, deep out there. To, ooh, incomplete. You got Vinny and Pluck out there on the coverage. It's tough. It, it, it was tough to start it up. Now, towards the end, they found their mojo, stuck in a couple wins to get themselves into the Elite Eight. Right now, they're playing against the number one team, which is the Baltimore Goobles. Mark at the QB, pitch out there to Momo. Uh oh. Uh, Momo. Oh, Momo making a couple guys miss. You got Cal Bone on the tackle, number 42. Twenty-three pluck out here against keep matched up against Keon. Oh, oh, out there, oh, quick! One thing Mark going to do is get uh, the Vipers QB. Mark is going to do is get that ball out quick and fast. This is probably going to get thrown out of bounds. And my boy Ma Reese. Reese on the line. Along with 74 Matt. Dan Butch out there at the wide. Hand off the slick. Sweet right. Uh-oh. Woo! He's booked. They got a different little offensive look this week. Vinny. Who? Ace Boogie. Who? Who? Ace Boogie. On the sideline. Who? Supposed to be in the pitch right. Uh, skipped out on the pitch right. Took it himself. Nice. Great. Now Gators won championship last year. Let's see if they can repeat. Do it again. Back up, a few backup players. A lot of backup players, no lie. Everybody plays on the Gators. No egos and just great spirits over there with the Gators team. Uh, Ace Boogie. Uh, Looking up there in the deep. Ooh. Along with Nick Mays in the backfield. Vinny back there in the backfield. D Butch at the wide. Ace Boogie. Uh, stepping up. Looking. Ooh. Great tackle. Motion out. He's booked. Oh, back. Look in. Oh, he's boogie breaks the pocket. Look in. Oh, sack. Number 44. And Mud Dog snag Sosa's checked in. Number 25, Nick Mays, the up back. Vinny looking. 
Ooh. Snag Sosa on the wheel route. Snag Sosa up the sideline. Ooh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Snag Sosa make one miss. Touchdown. Gators. I mean. And it looks so effortless for the effortless for them Gators, man. Veterans out there, baby. Man in motion, Lando. Oh, Lenny's scrambling. Oh, out there. Ah, conversion's good. Court. Great catch by Lando. Ham ah, throw off. Let's go. Oh, Justin. Uh, oh, trying to make a guy miss. Uh-oh. Sly's not one of them guys that you're going to make miss. Sly will get every single finger, tip, nail on you just to make that tap. Key on in motion. Uh, oh, sweep out here to Marty. Mm, look at. Oh. Gutter ball. Oh, uh, ooh. what the heck? Wow. Ball came out like a punt. Free and out that fast. Jeez. Uh-oh, ball's in. Vinny, let's go. Vinny, uh-oh. Oh. 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 Vinny was trying to make anything happen. Oh. He's boogie. Stepping up, oh. taking off. Out of bounds, he's boogie. Gate a second to drive. Already went up top. So the nice TD to snag Sosa on their first drive. Let's see if they can do something here this second drive. You got Tony Roberts, number 10 out there, the wide snags. I mean, slide boogie in the slot. Uh-oh, uh -oh, Super Saiyan. Oh, Super Saiyan right there. Oh, number five. Oh, ha. Super Saiyan is a electrifying player. One of my personal favorites. Gators break the huddle. Trips left. Trips left. Still with Tony Robbins, slide boogie in. Super Saiyan, you got Nick Mays in the tight end. Ooh. Uh oh, Super Saiyan. Woo! Touchdown. Uh oh, here you go. Watch him. Watch him. Boom. I love him, y'all. I love him. If that don't fire you up, man, I don't know what could or what would. Coming out, Lenny Manziel. As the QB of the Gators. Lenny Manziel drives back. Lenny Manziel's looking, steps up. Ooh. Ooh. And it is good. First down. Throw off. Oh. 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 Fumble. Woo. Katie's ball. Who? Nick Mays. Ooh. Ooh. Nick Mays, main machine. Hit that corner. Uh oh. To the corner. Woo! So that's main machine right there? Lost He's a lot of weight. Lost a lot of weight. Lost a lot of weight, indeed. See that block? That's my man. My man was on, my man was on that low carb diet, I can see. <laughs> yeah. Last time I commentated uh, with Meme Machine, man, he was a big boy. He was bigger than me. Yeah.
Me and Miss Shane lost a lot of weight. Hey, I, Vikings, Vikings need this. They, listen, they, this is a big, this is a, a big stop. They can get this stop here. Yeah. Got tight. You're good, you're good. I got tight. Ace Boogie looking to run. And the flag is down. Let's see what the call is on the field. And that was went a big down, tackle right there. Went down funny. Ace Boogie. Got Lenny Manzo with the wide out there with Lando Hamilton. Ace Boogie at the QB. Me and Machine in the backfield. Oh, Lando Hamilton wide open. Oh, wow. Right into Lando, Ham Lando Hamilton up the sideline. Touchdown. Touchdown Gate is another one. That play, he ran that play action and he ran that slant across the field and he was wide open. Yep. What defense? Who was covering that guy? <laughs> These Gators looking like looking like the number number one seeds out of Baltimore division. Yeah, looking to get into looking to get into the Final Four. Got Lenny Manziel at the quarterback for the Converse. Snag Sosa. Uh oh, out there the Ace Boogie. And good and defense there. Ace Boogie looking for that, see if he can get up top there, but <laughs> it's a good defense by the Vipers, so the score remains 20 zip, 21 zip. So let's see what, uh, now let's see what happens. As my man Long Live Marty, Sly Boogie throws it off. And Marty Mart, my man got a lot of energy. Let's see if he can make a play. Two. Not, not enough, not it. enough. And I always said, I, I, you know what I always said? The, the players that just those hard runners, are not the best to put on three on one. You no. know what I'm saying? The players that usually are usually the ones that, that come off is those ones that have that agility, that elusiveness. You know what I'm saying? That hit that sideline quick. Martin Martin's just more like a just a hard runner. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Hit the hole, and then you know you tackle him, goes down. You know what I'm saying? Like he's not, you know, he's he's, he's a good he's a he's a good back, but not not who I would like to see uh, on the Vipers. Um, on the Viper, I mean, who do they who else do they have? They have someone else that probably you like better. Yeah, yeah. They got the kid Justin, but Justin just fumbled on the, the one before that. Oh, got him. Yeah. Uh, play action. Mark looking. Outside oh, good pass. Keon. Keon. Ooh. That's shut down corner. That's shut down shut down. corner. That's shut down. That's, that's, that's 100 percent shut down. Wow. You, you, you ain't getting that. I, I thought for some reason. I swear, I, I, I would throw for some reason. If you would have just, if you would have just saw the pass and just paused it, and you would have saw the the, dip, the separation uh -huh. between the DB. Yeah, yeah. I thought, be honest, I thought it was gonna go. I thought he was gonna be a good pass. <laughs> uh -huh. And then for some reason, my man, my man just broke away, and went up there and says no. Vibers got, Vibers got to make a play soon here. The fans are calling his name. Ooh. oh, good pass. Ooh, definitely good route. Go route. That was the that's the one receiver I was telling you about that the, the, the Vipers do have. Yeah. So he was eating. So last week, yeah. So he was actually he was actually doing he was actually putting up numbers that last week. Okay. Let me tell you what I love about this Baltimore defense. Look, they bumping everything on the yeah, time. Yeah. Oh, just need none of that. So the Vipers have their hands full down twenty one zip. Second and long. Just sweet. Woo! Uh, good ball! Uh, oh! Man, Vin, you're a drop there. He had an opportunity to be able to, be able to pick that off. Fight break the huddle. Got Mark back there at the QB. Not your everyday QB. Call me about 300. Oh. Oh, there go that jet sweep right there. Justin. Ooh. Oh. It's your boy Vinny again. Yeah. So so Vinny, so uh from D Washington DC native. Every time that jet sweep comes to his side, he's letting you know I'm I'm gonna be on all that, sir. Oh, jet sweep out there. Another jet sweep. Justin. Vin Rira. Woo! 
good hit, but it looks like that's gonna those he's gonna move them chains there. Yeah, yeah. It's tough, you know. You're asking you're asking a lot out of a DB to be able to. He got fight. He got fight that receiver. Right. You know what I'm saying? The block it and still make the tackle. I was looking at a, a second and fourteen here. Okay. We're at Babe Ruth Stadium again. I'm um we're live right now in Baltimore, Maryland, Babe Ruth Stadium. I'm L. J. Smith alongside here with Ike Johnson. If you're just tuning in, this is American Seven Football, seven on seven, full contact football, no equipment. You are watching. This is the Baltimore Division. The um, the winner win or go home. This is the Vipers on offense versus the number one seeded Gators at the Baltimore Division. Good pass. Oh, I'll get a Momo. Nothing. Good pass to Momo, but short. I mean, they could. You know, if I'm the Gators, you know, I'll give them those two, three yard plays all day. You know what I'm saying? Eventually, they're gonna have. Eventually, what they're gonna have to do is they're gonna have to. They're gonna have to throw the ball pass. They're gonna have to complete the pass further than ten yards. Yeah. They went to the toilet corner? Yeah, both of them. And why, why Why do you think they made that change? Um, A lot of times they make the change due to, due to uh, like what's out there on the field. Uh -huh. But I didn't see a reason for them to make the change yet. Oh, it's up. I mean, I don't see anyone. I, I, I mean, I see a ball going up. <laughs> but I don't know. You got receivers. You got, you got receivers running, you know, routes running into each other. Mm-hmm. Oh yeah, he fast too. And let's see where Marty Mar puts that ball. Ah. He's boogie. Yeah, easy in the backfield. Out there to slip. Oh. We got seven minutes and change remaining in the first half. This is my man Ace Boogie. Oh, out there to slip. Another pitch. Woo! Oh, Vipers can get there. Ah. So good play by the. It's a good tackle. Way to break down. He sniffed. He sniffed that 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 play out. He's boogie at the QB for third down and fifteen. Oh, that Looking. post is there. Easy. That post is there. Oh, oh good defense. He got to come back and get good it. Good defense. Cut it back there. Makes up blocks. He's can he get there. Hey. Oh. oh wait, there's a flag down. What's the flag on the play? Got to come back. Receiver got to work back to the ball. Yeah. He was still working up the field. That's still good defense, though. Yeah, it was good deep. So they bring that six back. We're going to find out from the official, officials here. And, again, I know we, we always talk about this, right? I know it's easy said and done. But, again, if the Vipers are to stay in this game and to make this game competitive, they got to score right now. Yeah. yeah. They got to stop, right? Obviously, Ace Boogie is not, a, is not a quarterback who throws a lot of picks. So they got to capitalize on this one right now. And look at this formation. Another tackle by Vin Ure there. And shout out to all the Vipers that, they, that that believe in this game, that believe they could come and win this game. Shout out to all of them. <laughs> <laughs> because the odds are not in their favor. This is a huge game in Vi for Vipers if they can pull this one off. Yeah. Oh. 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 Oh, that's a hard running by Marty Marr. Tony on the tackle. <laughs> Good idea. He just need a little bit. He just need a little bit more on that one. Good idea. Hey, left, right? Motion down. 
check that the defensive end. Next loop around, get that mother. And we're going to toss left. Or set on set right there. Send me. Yeah, Send come on. Come on. Okay, this first down. Yeah, this is more as though that natural look. Woo! Snag Sosa. Good crack. Blocked by Lando Hamilton, number two. Great run by Snag Sosa. Anytime, anytime, anytime Snag Sosa, you know, anytime he touches the football, it's always a good, you know, it, it, you, you know something electric is about to happen. Yeah. He's so elusive and so small, he gets through his little cracks. As soon as he sees daylight, it is it is bye-bye. Oh, Kyle Mitch Meacham. Oh! <laughs> And it looks like, and I hear the Vipers clapping, it looks like there's going to be a call on the Gators. And that's a holding on 25 Snag Sosa. So that, that, uh, that touchdown is going to come back here. Listen, if it ain't broke, it ain't fixed it. He ran the same exact route before in that interception, right? Yeah. Different receiver, but obviously. So that's obviously... Obviously, that's something that um, that that Ace Boogie likes. He likes that post, the inside post route. So the call was holding, so it will be a ten yard penalty replay down there. Third and it looks like it's going to be third and third and uh, third and twelve with a minute and two left in the first half. Ace Boogie got to make a Boogie. play oh, here. Snack, snack Sosa. Sosa. Oh! And the Viper's doing everything, everything they can to keep to stay within this game here. Because usually Snack Sosa takes some things and get loose, you know what I'm saying? Mm hmm. And folks, no matter if you're on the field or off, staying safe is the number one priority. That's why we've partnered with Zoombang, brought to you by Marshall Lynch's Beast Mode. Zoombang provides world-class protective gear for not only athletes, but also military and medical professionals to ensure their jobs confident are protected. That they, that they do, excuse me, they do their jobs confident and they are protected. Zoombang also utilizes polymer technology to protect you no matter where you are. For more information, check them out at um, zoombang.com. Uh, we got a little less than a minute rem remaining. In the first half, this is the Baltimore Gators uh, versus the Vipers, and we are we, we're gonna see if the this is a, a huge stop here for the Vipers. Gators number one undefeated in twenty in the in twenty twenty one eight seven NFL season in the Baltimore division, looking to get a piece of that twenty thousand dollars cash money. And this is fan favorite, my man Ace Boogaloo. He's buggy. Third down, five. Tony Roberts in the backfield, along with Snag Sosa. Now listen, I mean, it, it, he, he fell. Is he hurt? I don't, is he hurt? Throw off. Oh. And start of the second half here, and here we go. The Gators back on the offense on a three on one. Oh, he got yeah. some separation. Oh, he got some time. Can he catch up to him? See you. Touchdown, Gators. <laughs> they said he just got here. He said he just got here. I was just scored touchdowns. He was here, but he wasn't dressed. Oh, okay, he was he was here, but he wasn't dressed. Yeah, yeah. Oh, this is the Johnny Menzel lookalike right here. My man, the Johnny Menzel, the Johnny Menzel lookalike. Got to make a play. Oh, you, you know he you know he got to loosen this. Oh, oh, good ball, good pass. Good pass, boy. Great pass by Lenny. 
That's my man Lenny Menzel, the, the Johnny Menzel lookalike. The Gators said the Vipers are their, are their JV team. They're the little, they're, they're the little laws. <laughs> so with the touchdown, return, six plus two is eight. That's bring, push up the score to 29 zip. Vipers need to get on the board now. This is my man Marty Marr. Marty Marr with the Superman sign. Oh. 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 Marty Marr. Can't get, can he get away? Marty Marr, can he got that strength? No. So let me tell you something. Not only does 20, not only not only does 21, 21 score a touchdown, but he the first one out in to make a tackle. But there's a flag on the play. Mm. Oh, good pass. Oh, not there. So let so that so that right there, that bad pass is because that pressure is coming. Yeah, yeah. That pressure, he's try, he's making that pass off his back leg, and he's supposed to actually step into that pass. If he if that pressure's not there, and he steps to that pass. That's a completion. Great route running, great route call. The receiver is open. Ooh. Oh, Marty Marr. For, from why? There you go. First down. And, and that's a it, it, first down. And that's a first down Vipers. And that's exactly the power game that I was just talking about. That's exactly what they need to do to move these chains here against this against this stout uh Gators defense that's been just, just dominating all the game. First down. Mark at the QB. Momo shifting out the wide. Marty in the backfield. Got Kia moving in the motion. Oh. Listen, nothing good has really happened out of these jet sweeps. They need nah. to, they, you know, they, they need to toss them out. Them, for some reason, them jet sweeps are usually successful against these DBs. These DBs are obviously not, these receivers are not able to block these DBs, right? Plus, they're on the line of scrimmage, too, so... If the DBs are, you know, if the DBs are playing three to five off, maybe you have a chance to get some blocking and get maybe a little yardage. But when they're bumping on line of scrimmage and they see and they see that that play coming in motion, they're already anticipating that jet sweep. So it's going to be a second. second that's going to be a second and about seven here for the Vipers. Ma, Keon in motion. Uh, fake the jet. Oh, oh. Oh, it's a big boy. He's a big boy. Like I told you, like I told you in pregame, I haven't seen him sacked. <laughs> you don't see him get sacked a lot. And you know what that sack is? You know, you know what it is? Those DBs are bumping at the line of scrimmage yeah, so yeah. bad, right? They're bumping their receivers so bad that the receivers can't even get, can't even run a solid slant. And that is the definition of a cover sack. Yeah. They literally are bumping them so hard. So Vipers break the huddle. A third, third, third and long here. Third and about third and long nine. You got Marty Martin in the backfield. Got to make a play. Four down territory. More than likely, the Vipers are going to like to go for it. So you're going to get about a four and about a four and about three or four here for the Vipers. And again, folks, if you're just tuning in, I'm LJ Smith, alongside here with Ike Johnson. We're live right now, in Baltimore, Maryland. We are at Babe Ruth Stadium in Baltimore, Maryland. You are watching. Uh, you're watching the Vipers here in the, uh, in the white and green uh, versus the number one seed Gators out of the Baltimore division, and it is currently fourth and about three or four here. Uh, fourth and about four, yeah, fourth and about four, and the Vipers need to get the, they need to get back in this game right now. Drops back. Ooh, let me tell you something. Like that 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 route has been there all day. Yeah, yeah. It's been there all day. Yeah. That deep out has been there all day. But the problem is though is that he the D line is coming in so fast. The quarterback is playing. He's he's playing. He's he's, he's playing rattled. You know. He doesn't know. He know. He doesn't. He doesn't know if he's going to get a block. Will he get a block? Will he get hit? Uh huh. Oh, 
Good pass. What a pass. Tony Roberts. What Ooh, a I, pass. Uh, Tony Roberts. Wow. Woo. Come on, what, baby. What a pass by Ace Boogie to Tony Roberts there. Giant his finger trying to stiff arm. And that's going to be a first down Gators. Snag Sosa said it. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. <laughs> Touchdown. Uh-oh, the Johnny Menzel looking like. For the conversion. Up there to Ace Boogie. Oh, oh! Ace Boogie! Ace brings it down, and that is good. They said, stop playing with my quarterback. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. Great. And that pushes the score up to 37 nothing. And 824, wait, 824 left in the third. If I'm not mistaken, that is three points away from the cold blooded mercy rule, right? Uh oh. Uh oh, folks. They might be getting, they might be getting my man I can LG out of here sooner rather than later. Throw off. And here we go in the 3 1 throw off. Ooh, Ooh, knocked off the Kofi. Anytime someone tackles you and your head flat, and your head, your hat fly the opposite way, that's not a good sign. And here we go, another jet sweep inside run. That's good running. Ooh, what a hit! And he kept moving. That's what you call a power game. That's the kind of that's listen. Listen, if you're going to run at some type of offense with Marty Mar, that's the kind of offense. You got to run that ball between the A and the B gap. Yeah, yeah. Once you start going to the C and the sweep, I just, I don't like that, you know? Marty Mar power back. He's up strong. He's, a, he's, he's, he's you know, he don't see, he's really, he's a, he's a high back, too. He's tall. He's, stay, he's staying up high. You got to get him. He's a power back. Get him in between the A and the B gap. And he's had success with that. Inside zones right there. Inside zones. Traps. Yep. First down, a big game by Marty. Oh, oh, good pass. Oh, oh, good defense there, though. That's Vinny. That boy is shut down, man. I've been talking about my man Vin Yura from a D Washington, D.C. He said he's a shut down corner. They need, to be, they need to stop testing him. And the Vipers. Trying to see if they can escape this game at least with some type of with some type of offensive offensive progression. Get on the boards. Get on the boards here. Another hey, power game by my man Marty Mard. And I'm surprised. You know, it's so funny. I've been running. I would have been running that all day. Yeah, yeah. You know. So first and ten here for the Vipers. They better stick to that power game. No. And that is my man Me Machine with the sack, but Me Machine on a low carb diet. Still still effective, still making plays. Even 150 pounds lighter. Second down and 15. Oh. Oh, good ball. <laughs> what? Well, back to Marty Mar. Mark, let the QB key on coming in motion. Oh, fake the sweep. Uh. Oh, that's good. And that is a touchdown. That is a touchdown. Went up top, chicken box on him. And yes, sir, was it on Vinura? No, nah, I was on Joe. I was on Joe? Okay. Because I know Vinura was, was Ike's pride. That, that's, that's, that's pride. You, I know usually you'd be pick, you'd be like, this guy shut down, that's not going to happen. Mm -hmm. I think in the first game when we, when the Renegades, who was the, who was the one you said shut down, that's not happening? Number no. 11, Nani Foster. Yeah, number 11. And now Vinura is the, uh, in this game, um, Ike said they got some shutdown corners that they don't be doing none of that. 
mm. and which he's been he's been speaking facts. Listen, every time there's a score like a, like a big play or something, it's not going towards these the DBs that that I've been telling me. So if you're a gambling man and you want to you want to bet on something that's going on with these Baltimore Baltimore teams, come holler at him. <laughs> My boy Vent. Going into the end of the third quarter here with the Vipers putting up six here, trying to avoid the. Uh, this might go crib. Oh! Oh, might take it to the crib. Oh, wow! And not only did he get the ball, but he got the penalty. I would say that might go to the crib, but that, that you know, that drop cost him, you know? <laughs> That's why number 21 should have been out there. Last time 21 was out there, he took it back for six. I don't know why 21 was not in the game. Fans want to know. Last time he was in the game, he scored. Why is he on the sideline? The fans want to know. I don't know, man. The chance of getting losing the game is unlikely, right? But as we, you know, as we want to stay, you know, we want to stay positive for the for the Vipers fans. You know what? Oh, good pass. Good pass, good catch. And that is a touchdown by the Vipers. And look, right back in it. Told you. Right back in it. I told you. Right back in the game here. And I said this last week, the last time the Vipers was in New Jersey. When a quarterback with a strong arm and receivers, it's they always got a pot, they always got a chance to score. And he's getting time back there too now. Oh, that's a flag. That gotta be a flag. Unless he can make a play here. Sideline. To the crib. Woo! Oh, he got energy. Wow. Stiff arm. Told you. And he told to him. I warned him. I warned him. Can get, get up off. That's a touchdown. I said it. I said, LJ, if they give him the football, it's a He's touchdown. Going to the crib. He going to the crib for six. And he cracked. And it looked like they got my man Long Live Mari at quarterback with the Menzel, with Johnny Menzel looking like in the backfield. Long live Mari. Up there, the line. The lob though. up top. Incomplete. Last time I seen Long live Mari throw a lob pass like that, that was to my man 5-0 back in 2018. Throw off. And it, hold on a second. Hold on. And a 3 one throw off. And here we go. My man got some speed. Last time he had his Kofi knocked off here. Can he hit that sideline? Oh, no, man. And then he knocked it off again. Good return, though. That'll be a first and ten. <laughs> Vipers. Ace buggy on the tackle. Oh, Chris Green over here. Oh, and good play on. call. Who? So this is the receiver that Ike was saying that before he hurt his wrist, before he broke his wrist early in the season, that he was um, he was up to um, he was being recommended for, uh, for talk to about MVP, right? MVP of the league. And broke his wrist. It bro it broke his wrist, unfortunately, and um, missed some games. Had to recover, and now he's back. Now he's back here playing in the uh, in the do or die elimination game. Oh, uh, oh, he got uh, him. Oh. And complete. Good D by my man Vin Yuri there. Another an, another receiver who looks like he has this is another receiver that looks like he had the step. And as I gives me that look, I looking at me like this, like you know, I like listen, man, I told you, LJ, Vinuri got that Vinuri got that closeout speed. Cause I could have sworn that was going to be a, a big play right there. And that started the fourth started the fourth quarter here. And start of the fourth here. It is third, third and it about two started here. Four. Just started. <laughs> oh, hard running by Marty Marr. Who? Oh. <laughs> Had the team roll with Marty. Vipers got to make a play right now. Just down. Oh, oh, good play call. Good pass. Momo. 
So fakes the jet sweep, fakes the fakes the toss to the to the right, froze the entire defense, and then that running back who use who they usually leave for the blocker just went ahead and split that went split that defense line and was wide open in the middle for that for that middle pass. So great play call by the Vipers here. The Vipers and I like the Vipers gears as well. I like the Vipers. oh, it's a power game back to Marty Marr. Ooh. Marty right Marr. Marr. So that's Marty what they listen. Let me tell you something. So if if if, if if the, you know when these vipers go back and they look at they analyze the film and they take a look at this film, I mean that's been there all day essentially. You know what I'm saying? That that power game's been there all essentially. Oh, cross it! Oh, incomplete. incomplete. I mean, and, and, and realistically, you know. The chances of the Vipers coming back right now is unlikely, but they can finish strong. Again, this season has been a success. The last team, the last time a team has been this deep in the playoffs as an expansion team, you know, it's, it's, it's been years. I, don't, I can't remember when the last time that's happened. Oh, what ball? Good pass. Good pass. Ooh. What a pass, Marty Mar. What a pass. And I can tell you right now, the passing you was watching this tape and said, listen, <laughs> I hope those start. I hope these are not the DBs that they start in the game. But you know, I, I see a lot of I see a lot of their key guys on the sideline as well for the, for the Gators. So both games have been goodies. You know what I'm saying? We have both game. You know, first games, both games have been goodies. You know, just an emotion. <laughs> Mark looking, rolling out. Ooh. And there's a flag on the play. And it was against and it's against the Vipers, so the Gators have elected to decline the play. And that'll that'll stay as an incomplete pass here. The Vipers are going for the conversion again. Just sweet, nothing. A fan favorite here, folks, Snag Sosa. You gotta definitely check him out on Instagram and on TikTok. He be doing the whip wop on TikTok. My man, Snag Sosa. Snag Sosa. Snag. Can he get away? Can he get out there? Snag. Oh. This is the Gators right now. One man, Ace Boogie. Hand off. Ooh. Ooh, so, and that is what you call some hard running there. Second down, ace boogie. Easy in the backfield. Mamma back there. At the up back. Ooh. But yes, sir, they will be traveling to New Jersey to play in the final four as long as they long as they just keep as long as they keep killing this clock and uh moving that moving that chain. Hang out the easy. Ooh, Ooh, hard hit. Second down coming up. Ace Boogie. Snag so, so easy. Back there with him. Man, man, in motion. Oh. Pitch out there to Snag Sosa. Snag Sosa. The, and that is a touchdown for the Gators. We've been waiting. For, we've been waiting for Snag Sosa to score. And plus, a lot of a lot of people also say that you know, like the 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 the, the worst team in Baltimore division is as good as the fourth best team. You know what I'm saying? The Jersey. That's what they. Listen, that's what they be saying. <laughs> wow. That's what they be saying. They said outside of BIC and the U, who does Jersey really got? And as doing this three on one throw off, miss one. Woo! Miss two. Hey. Oh man! You know, I mean, if y'all want to score, you can just run out clock. But let's see what they're gonna do here. A uh, toss over here to my man Marty Mar. Oh, Marty Mar using some moves here. Marty Mar. They need to just need to just recruit other players. Mm -hmm. Oh, he's open. Oh, your boy's open number one. Nope, he's nope, wide open. Nope. Oh, oh, no, video. Nope, How'd nope. he do it? I tried. Listen, to tell you that boy. I tried to tell me. 
Listen, he put him in motion, and he was oh, he was listen. He, I, I'm telling you guys, if was, I had if I had money, I would bet he would have been wide open. I mean, he was wide open. He was open. And yeah. then Vin Yura just put in that kick. He just put in that comeback speed. Keon in motion. Oh, sweep out there. Wow, touchdown Vipers. And that's just a that's just listen. That's just a power game. It's the end of the game. Mm -hmm. The Gators is like, you know what? We advancing. Uh, should I tackle him? I got to be at work in a couple hours. So the Vipers, so the Vipers score late is another example. As like I said, they got something special here, you know. Because you're not gonna see a lot of teams. I mean, how many? How many? Uh, let me ask you. I, I mean, you see this. You, you out here? How many teams is putting up this many points against the Gators, especially in the playoffs? Honestly, not not right? too many. So this just shows that this this just shows the heart of this team as far as just finishing strong, you know. Oh, that wasn't like that was on my boy. Yeah, conversions don't count. We don't count conversions. <laughs> conversions is tough. Five yards. Yeah. And here we go, folks. A three on one. My man, Cal Bone. Cal Bone. Hey, Cal Bone got the energy. Hey! You fight him off? Oh! <laughs> Cowboy. They want to look at that score and see. They want to see. They want to see ninety. Yeah. Oh, six C's wide open. Look at six C. Oh, Ace Boogie. Oh, oh good pass. Oh, the ball slipped out his, at his hand, and there's a flag on and a flag on the play here. And he drops his shoulders and getting there for six. So that is a touchdown. Great Gators. Touchdown by slip. I know I, you didn't expect. I mean, uh, I didn't I, listen. I didn't expect it to get ugly this fast, right? I didn't expect the games to be ugly. Um, but as you mentioned earlier, you said these Gators. You said these Gators. Are, you know, the Gators came to play, right? Yep. So it's going to be exciting to see them. It's going to be exciting to see exactly what the Gators do next week. We'll have the matchups posted on A7FL social media. If you're not following us at A7FL.com or on Facebook and on Instagram. Uh, again, I'm LJ Smith. Again, uh, signing out with Ike Johnson from uh, Babe Ruth Stadium out of uh, Baltimore, Maryland. Checking out. Again, thank you, for thank you for following us. Good night. God bless. This has been a broadcast of the American Sevens Football League. Like. Follow and share on our Facebook page at A7FL TV.